Hey guys, me here. So today I'm going to be showing you guys my K-pop album collection spreadsheet. This is how I digitally can see how um, I organize my K-pop albums and what I own and what I still need. And I found that with so many uh, albums and such that is just the easiest way. And also when I was in school and I wasn't with my collection all the time, this was the easiest way for me to keep track of it. So I do have a Mac, so I use Numbers instead of Excel because it comes with my computer. But I personally really, really like Numbers and I feel like you can do a lot more with it than Excel, at least in my opinion. So I'm really happy with this program, even though I only use this because it's like the only one that I have. I did think about keeping this on a Google spreadsheet originally, but I decided that it was just easier to have it on my computer, but I do have a Google spreadsheet, which I always link in the description box for photo card sale trade, album sale trade, um, all that stuff. So if you're ever interested in what I'm selling and trading, I haven't updated that in a while, but I plan on doing it soon. Probably not before you see this video, but. So I have this organized by my five ultimates and then everyone else and then photo cards. So I'll just really quickly go through kind of how I have everything laid out. So for Super Junior, I have Korean, Japanese, and then I have all of their subunits. These aren't really in any particular order, it's just when I was first making this, the order I gave it. So everything it says at the top that I own is in black and everything that I still need is in red. So at the top I have the name of whatever category it is, and then I have how many things I still need, and the black number is how many things I own. And I have it set up so that all of these black numbers add up over here as you can see the whole thing just got highlighted um to the total number of super junior albums that i own which is 118 which is insane infinite is set up in a very similar way we have their korean japanese hf sungyu buyan um and then hoya and then i do have their dvds and photo books down here i haven't added this for super junior yet because i think it's still going to be a little bit until i really start collecting photo books and dvds from them um, but Infinite, this is kind of where I am in their collection, and this should be red, it's just not red because I just added this the other day. Yeah, again, everything adds up here, the end, which equals 81 Infinite <laughs> items. Oh my gosh, it's crazy. These three I actually added recently, they originally were in the Everyone Else category, but I figured since Infinite and Super Junior got their own tabs that they should all get their own tabs. So here's Monster X's, it's purple because... I don't know. <laughs> they don't really have an official color yet. Um, as you can see, I only have 19 Monstex items, so that's why I'm always like, they have so little compared to Infinite and Super Junior for my male ultimates. Um, but same thing, I have their Korean and their Japanese here, um, and they don't have any subunit stuff because they're still a pretty young group, so yeah. Um, a pink is pink, of course, that's their official color, but I have their entire green discography here, which once you separate it from the Japanese discography, because originally this was all one thing, it's pretty small, which makes me sad. Um, and then I have a couple of things that I still need from their Japanese discography. So yeah, I have 32 A pink items. And then for after school, I have Korean, Japanese, orange caramel, and then Reina. So I have 27 after school things, it's so small. They do have other things that I can collect, so it's not like the end for this. So then I have everybody else. So you notice all of these numbers at the end also appear right here. So I have, this is actually the wrong number, it's 118. Let me make sure the rest of these are correct real quick. So these, I have not, I'm not like super savvy at this, so I haven't figured out a way to get the number from this tab over here. So I just kind of update it when it needs to be updated. Um, also, this should all be black. I nitpick this a lot. <laughs> and then of course I have the other groups that I collect here. Um, and I try to keep this as updated as possible. It's kind of a struggle for some groups. Um, so this, if this isn't all completely correct, I think it is. I went through it last night and I was like, I'm pretty sure everything is correct. There is a way for it to count these, um, but I found that it counts also the red items and I don't like that. So yeah, 
So all the groups that I collect. This is just kind of everything I want from Big Bang, but I just don't know when or if I'm ever going to do that. Same with Epic High. I'm like, I really want their albums because they're actually one of the first groups I got into in K-pop, but um, I just don't know when that's going to happen. And then these are their YG albums and these are their Willem albums. Um, you Kiss, Sistar. Sistar is another one. I don't know if I'm ever going to get all of these. I don't know. I do want these things though. This should be in red because this isn't out yet, but I don't even really know what this album's called. I just know it's NCG 2018. Winner, so Winner's Collection, I don't have everything down there, but I do, OT12 includes Icon stuff, that's why I have the Win DVD under this because I got rid of my Icon collection. Um, but I do plan on keeping my Winner items. Nine Muses, Victon, IOI, Beast. Same with Beast, I don't have everything listed here. I should change this to Highlight. I always still call them Beast, so I need to get used to calling them Highlight. Um, 101, there's two versions. I haven't written that all in yet. Golden Child, Rain, Samuel, MXM, JBJ, Chunga. This is the opposite of what it should be. I'm not gonna fix it right now. Luna, <laughs> I have 11 Luna albums already. Um, oh my gosh. Card, I didn't write in the names of these things because I got lazy when I was doing this. So at the end, it adds all of the numbers, including my Super Junior Infinite things, up into 572 K-pop albums, which is kind of intense. There are a couple of, same with CLC, I don't have their entire discography listed because I don't think I want their entire discography. And it's really nice and it keeps me organized and I feel like, especially for groups like when I was collecting SF9, I need to be like, okay, which mini albums do I have and which one do I still need? Um, and Stray Kids, I'll write their debut album in here later, probably when I buy it. Uh, and this is my photo card tab, so this is a little different. Um, it's also not entirely updated, so I apologize in advance for the outdatedness. Um, Dong Yang and Sung I'm very, very good about keeping them updated, but the rest of this, especially if we go over to, where is Wano? Wano, it only goes through shine forever. <laughs> I have not added in everything for Decode yet because it's intense, but I will do that once I, I'm reorganizing all of my binders today, I think, is going to be that project. So, so as you can see, these have little drop-down menus on the side. So I have need, pending trade, pending sale, and own. Um, I don't use these pending options as much as I originally thought I would. I usually just use the need and own ones. Um, and I don't think this includes every single person I collect for photo cards yet. I think it's pretty close. Um, I want to cut down a couple of photo card collections. I'm not quite sure which ones. I don't have it by like group because I just know these things. Oh my gosh, Wendy's super outdated. I need to update that. So yep, that is it for my digital organization spreadsheet and how I organize my K-pop albums. Um, I will say that I mostly use this for photo cards now and not really albums because I live with my albums full time. But I still really, really like having this organization system and I think it really works for me. So yeah, let me know if you use any system like this in the comments down below and I will see you guys very, very soon. Bye.